At the memorial of the opposition, People's Democratic Party, PDP, was announced as a new minority leader by the Senate President, Godswiller Pabio, during plenary on Tuesday. He replaced Senator Simon Wadikwan, representing Play 2 North, under the platform of the PDP, who was sacked by the court on October 23. In every way, his name is not here. We have Senator Aliru, a very distinguished and rank senator, his name is not here. You have even the former speaker of the House of Representatives, the Swiss Senator Tambua, his name is not here. Taking cognizance of the number of senators in the minority caucus, you need to know that all you need to produce a leader is majority. If you are like 48 or 49, and 30 people have signed for one person, what is the magic that you say that it should not be announced? If you are like 48 or 49, and 41 people have signed, what is the reason why you say the Senate President should not announce? It's not everybody that will agree, but majority have agreed. So I will listen to points of order, but I want you to bear something in mind. In my front, I have two papers. Some are still signing, because not all of you have signed for Senator Bamoro. It would also be unfair for me to see somebody who has majority. And what he actually needs will be like maybe 24 or 25 senators, and he has up to 30. And then I will not announce it. An opera, however, ensued in the upper chamber when Senator Osita Ngu Enugu West PDP was announced Senate Minority Whip, replacing Senator Darlington Walker of the Labour Party. Senator Okechuku is here from Enugu North, rose to fault the nomination. His personal observation slash objection was backed by Senator Tony Wanyer of the Labour Party. Labour Party will equally rose to challenge the seating of three of the minority leadership to the PDP, leaving the Labour Party with no representation in the Senate leadership. Are we your slaves? The way you elected was the way you were elected. Are we your slaves? How you can suspend me here? Are we your slaves? Every time you keep on picking leadership for us. We are not your slaves. What are you like to do? The way you are elected was the way you are elected. We are not your slaves. The way you are elected was the way you are elected. How you can suspend me? You have done your worst, Mr. President. What do you mean by that? You have done your worst. You have done your worst. You have put us to the wall. Thank you. Yes, we start with that. Meaning what? Meaning what? Meaning what? Meaning what? It's unfair. Eh? It's unfair. It's not about me, it's not about any person. It's about the institution of Senate. Thank you, sir. After some senators pacified, Moye Pabir explained that the two minority leaders had shown the signatories of the senators who agreed with the decision. The Senate is in, um, my leader of the Senate, I, I would have loved to confer with you, but no problem. The Senate is in receipt of two documents signed by the minority caucus of the Senate. And uh, I've seen about 41 signatories here saying that they have a temporary replacement for the minority leader of the Senate. And this is a resolution of the minorities in favor of Senator Abba Moro. And having seen that he has about 41 signatories to his credit as majority, uh, minority leader of the Senate, I therefore have the privilege to announce that the senior Senator Abba Moro will move forward as a minority leader of the Senate.
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.